Welcome to this edition of Tech Talk. We're at Rainbow Mountain Ski and Board. I'm sitting here with Trevor. He's gonna walk us through some tuning techniques. But first of all, Trevor, why is it important for those people just not to get their skis out of the closet, take them up on the hill, they should come see you first? Well, like anything, uh, you know, uh, maintenance is part of the game. Uh, be the same as your car, not, you know, changing oil in your car. Eventually, it's not gonna be doing what you want it to. Um, you know, with the skis, the maintenance uh, is most common would be obviously a hot wax, and then, uh, after the hot wax, you do want to, you know, consider to keep the edges in nice good shape. You know, a sharp edge is going to hold a little bit better on the firm snow. And it's good to come see you guys because you can evaluate the equipment because maybe some skis or boards don't need that extensive treatment. That's a good point. Um, just because the skis need work does not mean that we have to uh, do a complete full tune-up on it all the time. Um, uh, you know, just an edge in a wax is a great way to start. Uh, very economical and uh, is going to keep the ski performing at top. Level. And the nice thing about coming to a, a shop like yours is you guys are up on the mountain every day. We're out there every day. We do know what the current conditions are and we will tune for the current condi conditions and so locks. You're going to start throwing a tune on this ski right here and while you're doing so you're going to talk us through some of the services you guys provide. That sounds great. Here we're going to just do a little uh, prep on a new ski getting it ready. This is some hand tuning that we're doing here. We're going to just uh, uh, set the bevel on the ski on the base edge. We're going for a one degree. Um, this is uh, the type of tuning that we would do at a higher end. This would be uh, what we would offer in our race tunes at the top level. Um, we also, you know, we start down at a hot wax, you know, that's your, your basic uh, service. We can do that uh, in the iron wax for current conditions, or we also have a belt wax. It's just a quick, economical way to do it. Um, from there, you know, an edge and a wax we can do where we're just uh, maintaining the edges and then getting the, the proper wax on there. And then from there, we have several levels of tune. We have our, uh, our standard tune, and then we have our deluxe tune, and then our race tune. And how often should people get their equipment tuned? Say, You should be doing one good tune a year. From there, you can definitely maintain it just with like edge and wax. Um, waxing is something that should be done every five times at the most out on the hill if you, if you want you know, proper performance from your gear. And then also, you guys can do more extensive gear, like, I mean, welding and stuff like that as well, right? We can do some very major repairs, uh, a lot of glue work. We can replace sections of edge in the ski. Um, uh, we can do full custom tunes for current race situations, anywhere from a slalom to a full-on uh, speed event, being GS, Super G, or downhill. And let's not forget the snowboarders. And the snowboarders, we can definitely cater to the snowboarders. Uh, there is a few things that the snowboarders like that are riding in the park a lot. There's a couple things we can do to help out in the park there and make that board perform better on the rails. And what are some of the tweaks that you're seeing for those park riders out there? Park riders, uh, they, they're wanting a little less edge than, let's say, your uh, carving skier or whatever. Um, some of the things we can do there is increase the base bevel, get the metal out of the way so they can slide on the plastic on the boxes or on the metal on the rails better without getting that edge to hook up and uh, having not so fun of an experience. <laughs> and let's talk about, you guys got a ton of equipment here. We, we do have a lot of equipment. Um, we're all uh, full Wintersteiger stocked with gear. Uh, we've uh, got a full Wintersteiger belt and stone grinder. We have uh, ceramic uh, disc edging is how we would uh, finish all our uh, gear. Um, and then quite a big supply of hand tools too. And this is the best place because you guys can actually pick up the gear and get it back to you before the next morning. We are a overnight turnaround. Not every shop in Tahoe will offer that. We will stay here till the sun rises if need be to make sure that people are out there the next day on the hill. There you are, come down and see Trevor. Rainbow Mountain Ski and Board. Thanks Trevor. Thank you. See you soon. Get these skis tuned up. We'll see you next time on Tech Talk.